hello guys and welcome to dtw tutorials welcome so in today's video i'm going to be taking you through the jam 2024 exam overview what you need to know okay i'm going to be taking you through um, a comprehensive overview of uh, the jam exam all right its structure uh, registration what you need to know because you need to uh, start some processes now before the forms are out and also important dates okay so we're going to be going through all this all right so um if it's your first time on the channel please do um click uh, the notification bell all right that's subscribe i, I apologize uh, subscribe to this youtube channel give this video a thumbs up and also share this video in your, with your friends uh you know i'm sitting for the jam 2024 exams and um you can share it on your groups okay because it's going to help I'm going to be taking you through the JAM website itself. All right, so what is, what's the overview of JAM? What's, how is the exam like? Okay, so you don't start getting scared. All right, so on the JAM uh, website, okay, so this is the JAM website. So every information I'm going to be giving you is from JAM website. So it's not me or my fabricated uh, information or I go to a blog post online and just copy and start telling you this is the jam website you can see it jam.gov.ng don't worry i'll show i'm going to show you how to get to this ibas information for students all right so the jam exam okay is a cbt computer based test all right where you use a computer the computer to sit for the exam and it says the format is flexible in that the test can be taken at different times in different locations all right i'm going to be showing you the time frame, okay? And why was in CBT introduced? It just makes it more, you know, accurate, you know, fair assessment of candidates. It, it tries to reduce malpractice. Are you with me? And within a few days, it's sort of, I remember when I took my jam, this is like 20 something years ago, you have to wait for, for machines to mark your scripts and all that. But with the jam exam, Within two weeks, your results are out, okay? And why it even takes that long is because they have to check, you know, for my practice, you know, everything is okay. So that's why it takes that long. But if your results can be, can be actually be um, given to you within, even within a few minutes after your exam, all right? But you know, Nigeria, we have to check or check everything. So that is about this, the overview of JAM exam is CBT. Okay, you know, it says here EUTM is an electronic form of the JAM exam that adopts the use of computer display and answer test items. Okay, so that's the brief overview. Now, the next thing here that we have is, uh, is brief overview and is structure. That's basically it. All right, and after that, to know about your um, registration process, okay, before you start registering all right i don't know why i'm going to show you the dates okay before you start registering you need to know about your school okay and your subject combination very important a lot of students make mistakes with this okay i've done a video on how to get your correct jam subject combination sometimes the subject combinations we get or maybe that's on the jam portal might not be updated. So I always advise students that no matter, you know, if you click here, it's like a PDF document that shows everything. I'm going to show you a, a software that you can use to get, you know, get everything here. All right. I'm going to show you quickly. But I always advise students that no matter, these are the various, uh, you know, states and institution, okay, education, where you enter education, it will show you all um, the schools and their requirements, all right? So, as I was saying, why I'm going through, um, why I'm going through this software, okay, this is the DTW Tutorials app, okay, it's a practice app for your JAM exam, all right, we have a new future, anyway, I'm going to, I'm going to explain this later in another video. We have a new feature which is called study materials. It has all your notes. It even has AI. You can ask AI questions on things that you find difficulty in. Okay. But the future I'm focusing here is this career in institutions. When you download, you can download this for free. Okay. You only activate it for all the 26 
thousand uh, past questions to have them offline. To activate it, it costs three thousand naira, but you can download for free and play around, play around it. And this is free to use. You don't need to activate to to get into this. So inside it, you can find your schools. You this is career guide. Career guide gives you like a uh, let's say uh, you want to do something like engineering. Let me say electronics engineering. Career guide tells you. What an electronic engineering person does, uh, electronic or electrical, you know, electrical. Okay. All right. It tells you everything about electrical engineering. All right. What are your responsibility? Things, skills you should have, employment opportunities. All right. So it tells you about that particular course. What's what is the future? Is there future in it and all that? You don't just pick any course like that, all right? Don't just say, oh, because you just had one course from random. Go and re go and research on that course. We AI take over that course. This is the 21st century, like, hey, in 21st century, uh, when 21st century and AI is here. And I tell you, AI will take over, whatever they are saying that AI will complement or whatever. Ah, it will take over some things. Are you guessing me? Just like the way um, the introduction of emails, you know, Gmail, uh, Yahoo, it took over postal, postal, you know, the postal services, writing of letters. It went into like negative. People don't write physical letters like that anymore because of email. You know, within a few seconds, the person has gotten it. So there are some there are some things that can take over some particular courses. So don't just go and do, just do a course. Come here and learn about the course. Okay? So that's what Career Guide does. This is free on the DTW um, CBT app. Okay? So just, you know, um, download it. Download the app. is free to download. It's just like cost 3000 to activate all the past questions. You can, you can practice about five questions, but after that, it stops you to activate to have the, all the past questions offline and the best thing about it it works without the internet okay now the best where you need to find your school and subject combination is this so we have uploaded all every the database that jam has here all right all the you can go here and check for your school and all that there's also a, a tool called the eligibility program checker you can also try this. I'm going to show you how to get to this part on the JAM website, okay? So coming back to the to here. So you check for universities. You can, let's say that electrical. I know that you don't see, you don't normally see electronics alone. It's either electrical or electronics. So look at schools that offer this. It shows you the competitiveness. All right, let us go into this. You say, usually the, the applicants for this Ladoke um university is like from 500 to 1000 all right what are the requirements click on requirements it shows you the subject combination do you see that english language mathematics physics chemistry you get me can you see everything that is needed about you entering into this school it shows you it's even we even drop here your the the school website and email phone number that you can call I tell students, please, even because there are some courses that, you know, you will see, they will say, um, let me let me put this administration and whatever, and let me check the requirements. So you can see like here, it says, <coughs> excuse me, it says English language, okay, the subject of specialization, and one each from arts and social science or arts and science or social uh, science and science. So when you see subject utme combination like this what do you do go to the university website get the phone number i don't know don't be scared get the phone number and call you are a student you're an aspirant that is going to be paying school fees you are like a client a customer look at universities like client to customer you know relationship are you with me not that you are begging to go no it's like a client to customer relationship that's the way it should be that is the way it is, okay? When you're going to school abroad, that's the way they treat you. You are a customer because you are bringing your money to pay. It's not free education. Are you with me? So call, 
and ask them, please, I want to sit for you to hear me. I want to confirm the subject uh, combination for this course in this department. Are you with me? And they will now tell you, because I've seen a situation where in a school, you know, on the jam uh, brochure is, is a particular subject combination, but when in the department itself, the requirement is different. Are you with me? So some students sit for it and they don't accept them because of the subject combination. So whichever school that you are that you are interested in going to, please call them and confirm the exact, you know, for sciences, it's usually very easy. Sciences, either you are doing biology, chemistry, uh, physics, and English, or by, uh, maths, physics, chemistry, and English is easier. But for social sciences and arts, it's usually very complicated and all that. They'll say, oh, pick this of social science, pick subject, pick one, either um, government, history, you understand what I mean. So please make sure you confirm with your university. And we have made this easy for you. Just, you know, go there, get the number and call and confirm the subject of combination before the jam registration starts. Do it now. Go and take, you know, take, I've shown you how to read about the course. After you read here, about the course, go online and check about the course. Okay, don't just pick a course and I'm going to school. No, 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 no. Okay, so you can see this, it shows you competitiveness. Let us go to the, it says competitive level um, three to five. So, yes, you can have a fair, you know, look at you see uh, top score range of top. So, with this, in this course, educational administration and planning, if you have a low jam score, you are likely to even gain admission. Your name can come out on, on a merit list. Are you with me? Sure, it shows you this is not very competitive. Three over five is not that competitive. But you see some crazy courses. Wait, let us let us go to medicine. Medicine. Let us go to medicine. Where is it? Medicine and surgery. Find. You see, see applicants five thousand and above. Five thousand, two thousand. Oh my God. Just let us just check the, the competitiveness. Look at this. Extremely competitive. Look at the score you must have. Are you seeing the score you must have? From 318 to 343. I've even had students that even that get 320. Don't even gain admission. So if you don't even get anything from 318, I don't know. Are you with me? So horses and their competitive nature. All right. In almost every school, medicine and surgery is very competitive. So if you are going for medicine, you should know that by now you should have finished your syllabus. And in January, you are practicing, practicing. I don't expect anybody that is going for medicine that is still not, that no, have not started reading at all. No, please go and start reading. I beg you. All right. So you can see this. It shows you everything. We have curated this for you. And it's free to use. Download and share. Tell your friends. Share. Okay. So when you download this, you share. Recommended courses, you know. No, you can go through this. I don't want to waste more more time explaining this. Okay, so this is how you check for your jam subject combination. More about the course in your school. Okay, then another thing, the next thing now we are done with the brochure is your syllabus. All right, the next thing is to get is your syllabus. So from the website you can come here. You know biology. You know it will show you everything on biology here. This is biology syllabus. But beautiful enough. I have curated with this same syllabus. I have done. Let me open this up for you. Why is it not opening it? One minute. Why is it not responding? Oh, everything is shut down. Uh, no. Okay, so I have curated a timetable for you, a 30 days timetable. And it contains everything in the syllabus. This is for physics, chemistry, and maths. Okay, I have for uh the hold on i don't know why this document isn't working it isn't responding well okay there's for commercial there's for arts if you need this particular 30 day syllabus you can see it here you can see them here there's for government history commercial accounting and english i have arranged everything according to the syllabus that is here according to the syllabus of each subject here all right so you can uh, fill in the Google form. That will drop a Google form, or the, you can join the Telegram group. The Telegram group, everything is in there. Just go to files and check. 
all right i'm going to show you the telegram group later you can join i think just join the telegram group all right because even on saturday we're going to be doing like a seminar please join the telegram group all right seminar um inviting other students that have scored 342 321 to share you know their experiences and stories to motivate you to study okay so now the next thing i think that we have here is you know i'm giving you an overview jam registration what to do all right i'm going to do a separate video i'm just this is a general overview so the video is going to be long but i'll do short short videos for you for jam registration please if you have not done your name go and do it this christmas time go and do your name don't wait till january when it starts then everybody's rush, rushing the name plat platform will be almost jammed i know of last year they say, ah, my name is not going it's not going it's not going go and do it now do your name how do you know how to do your name go to your local government sometimes you will see some people say name national name go you there's an amount of money you pay if you go to all those people if you go to local government i think it's free but if you want it faster you know go to all those people that will do your name for you but don't let them cheat you okay your parents yeah your parents go with you all right so it says your name if you forgot your name you can retrieve it here just make sure you have your name number by your side all right now the next thing after getting your name when the forms are out if don't worry i'm going to be sharing the dates when the forms are out you can see here you need one cell number please don't use two cell numbers and most importantly don't if you have a brother that has done jam before and use maybe your mother's number don't use that number again use your father's number or if you have your personal number use it okay and most importantly don't go and use a distant relation their number an uncle that maybe came to visit you use his number and he leaves no that number as you see here it is very important utmost important please use a number that you have that is registered with your a name okay so use that one cell number to generate your profile code okay so because this is what is going to be used to communicate with you and this is the way you generate your profile code when um the registration starts okay you are going to send the word name space then your 11 digits of name to this number it's going to charge, I think, 50 Naira. Are you with me? You can see this is the text message you send. Name, you leave a space, your name number, all right? And then after that, you receive a profile code, a 10-character profile code, all right? Regis and the registered name with NIMC on your phone, okay? So when you receive this profile code, is this profile code that you use to buy your form? So you go to a bank and buy your form, okay? When you go to the bank, the bank there's a process it when it, once it asks you for a profile code it does whatever on the back end then a an e pin will be sent to you okay this e pin is what you now go to you take to a cbt center for registration please go to the accredited accredited cbt centers don't just don't go to cyber cafe please my brothers and sisters all right don't go to cyber cafe go to a cbt center you will notice that CBT Center has a very large number, a large number of computers, like a big building. Are you with me? Go to a CBT Center. I think you will pay like 700 or 1,000. All right. So you take all these things, your profile code, your EPIN, your name to a CBT Center. And with that, all right, you can see here to note, so you are not also cheated. Your application cannot be completed until the candidate's fingerprint is verified. Okay. Successful successful verification authorizes a candidate to print his or her registration slip this is when everything is done correctly all right so you'll be you'll be uh, you know your fingerprints will be verified then after that your e-registration slip will be printed and given to you all right then later on if you want to do some changes you know maybe uh okay yes one important thing i forgot to mention please your name should be the same the name you are putting using to register register should be the same in your YX certificate. Don't make this mistake. A lot of students make this mistake. They will have a different name on their YX certificate, a different name on their registration. Say it's their mommy or daddy that said they should put this name. No. Check your YX certificate. Whichever name is there, please use it to register. 
not that you start running up and down for change of name and there's usually restrictions on change of name nowadays i think change of is it date of birth or change of name i can't remember but please make sure your name tallies your wayek the your name on your wayek certificate name on your name please important name on your name wayek certificate and the name you use for your jam registration should be the same please take note of this very important okay so you don't miss your chances of admission please don't let there be differences name on your wayek certificate name on your name name on your jam should be the same let it be consistent wherever let your name be consistent all right don't let mommy and daddy say oh use this name no tell them mommy see what is on my name here yeah. please when you tell them that they, they, they know that once there's differences there will be consequences so they they are mature they know that already and they will make sure everything is consistent please please do take note of this so this is how you generate your profile all right and after that you can see everything I'm reading is from the JAM website. It's not from my own words. Okay, so these are cases if when you lost your profile code, you know, if you have done JAM before, just use the profile code that you already have. If you have start for JAM, uh, so please be on the Telegram group so you can ask your questions. Any questions you have regarding registration, be on the Telegram group. I'll leave all the links to the groups in the video description box of this video. Okay, because I'm going to be dropping so many things we're going to be doing a seminar on how to register get your subject combination and all okay so which other thing is left here yeah recommended books so when you come here it shows you recommended textbooks for each subject let me clear this for each subject going into chemistry for example it shows you what you should use ababio understanding chemistry for colleges you know essential these are the books that you can use that would help you okay that aligns to the syllabus of jam all right and i've done um a there's a blog post everything here is curated on recommended textbook i will leave that link so you know to reduce your stress of always coming to click you see everything in that blog post on the gtw tutorials website now finally uh not finally yet how to you know go into that ibas now this is the jam website jam.gov.ng all you need to do is come to these quick links okay when you go down ibas right when you click click it it takes you to every information you can see it, every information about jam you can just read through it okay everything you need to know everything about the cbt contact everything is here all right so i don't want this video to be long i think uh what do i want to show you again okay yes so finally uh registration uh aha uh -huh, the important dates so oh sorry important date so why does jam registration start it starts january 15th to february 26 to 2024 okay so please as i told you if you haven't gotten your name very important go and get your name if you haven't started studying please start studying now i forgot to also mention we do jam online tutorials okay online live classes every day we run it all right i'm going to drop the link to that when you're on the telegram group anyway i'm going to be sharing all this we run online classes if you need to study okay please do join our online classes it costs three thousand naira per month okay the cbt app costs three thousand forever one time payment of three thousand you practice 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 till your exam you can use still use it any day any year okay for sell okay so that's when these forms are out and um so meanwhile the 7th of march is for the mock you know there's always a mock if this is your first time i advise students that if it's your first time using computers please go and sit for the mock sit for the mock if it's your first time for this exam sit for the mock okay because it helps you get that's why a mock you know this is this is a standard for test for computer based tests there's always a mock there's always a practice test before the main exam to get people ready uh, to use the computer so please if you don't know how to use the computer this is your first time for pay for the mock i think it's like 700 pay 700 extra for the mock please do all right pay 700 extra for the month while the main exam starts what april 19th how many months do you have 
see, just forget about December because I know December everybody is jolly, 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 party, party. In fact, students have even stopped reading right now. But if by uh, advice, still continue, continue to what study. So how many months do you have? You have January, February, March. I would just say you have three months. I won't count that uh, April first to nineteenth. No, no, because I know <laughs> by that time you should be. You should. <laughs> I won't count that. You just have three months. All right. You have three months. Please start studying now. Start early. So these are the important dates. March 7th, mock, the main exam, April 19th, and registration starts January 15th. Please join the Telegram group. Join, um, yeah, when you join the Telegram group, everything. I'm going to be, you know, asking questions and all that. I'll leave all the links to the groups. There's a WhatsApp group, there's a Telegram group, Facebook group. But WhatsApp and Telegram is a better, uh, you know, place to instantly message and we will uh, respond to you okay so i think that's all i've shown you how to go to the site okay yeah yeah that's all okay so finally please make sure you do get the dtw tutorials uh you know uh uh cbt to practice every of your subject all subjects are you with me you can practice uh you know for you can pick topics Maybe you finish reading Lexis and Structure in English. Just pick that topic and it brings out all questions on Lexis and Structure and you answer. You can see all subjects, 26,000 past questions here. And it's all offline. You can time yourself. I will do a video on this, okay? So just do get it to support us, all right? So yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Yeah, I hope I'm not missing anything because I want to give a comprehensive overview of this exam for those that have not sat for the exams before or you are confused about about it so that's it so thank you thank you from dtw tutorials don't forget finally that jesus christ is coming soon please do give your life to christ for he's the way he's the truth he's the life he's the one who will lead us to heaven at last and give us peace on earth so please you know turn away from any any ways that you see, you know that it's not right. We know the ways that are not right. Please turn away from that. And, uh, you know, if you are, the, if you've been depending on my practice, please turn away from it. Okay. Even if you have parents supporting my practice, tell them, mommy, daddy, don't worry. I can do it with God. Okay. And, um, that's why the DCW online tutorials, we are not just here to teach you. There's also going to be prayer sessions, motivation se uh, sessions. You can see there's one coming up on Saturday which you can join, free to join. Join the Telegram group and we are going to be sharing all this. Okay, so thank you. And, um, you know, Jesus is the way, the truth and the life. All right, thank you. Please give this video a thumbs up and share this video, video with your friends, family and loved ones. Thank you and see you in our next video.